trickle it is, but how little things like how the sniper spawns at the bottom, not the top, because all that does is have someone camp at top and he could just sit here and just, you know. Obviously the sniper would not shoot that fast in Halo 3, but, you know, this is the Halo 2 sniper, not Halo 3, so. Yeah, it's pretty straightforward on that part, but, uh, like I was saying, you know, little things like how the weapon placements are, you know, it seems like a lot of the weapon placements and reach are very random, and you just don't even, you can't really quite make sense of it, you know. Yeah, it, there's a tower right there, but why have the sniper spawn up top when it should, when you spawn it on bottom, you know, people have to, f people can fight for it better other than, you know, having it spawn up here and then people could just bounce nades and just kill people right off the bat. Or they can pick it up and go, go scope, you know, I just think stuff like that is just retarded because it kind of makes it unbalanced. I mean, yeah, it's a little thing to worry about, but... You know, little things tend to carry on a lot. Or, you know, a lot and far away, whatever. I can't really think of the word, sorry. I'm not really good with words, I guess. But, yeah, overshield, yeah. Listen to that sound, oh yeah. That's definitely Halo 2. Definitely miss this game. You got the airlift going right there. And you got the... I think this is blue base. The only thing I don't like, though, is this. How there's nothing there. But, I mean, the running speed and the jumping height is a lot better in Halo 2. Because it's... You're, you're more fluid. You're a lot more fluid. The animation and the walking speed, or running speed, you could say, it's a lot faster. So, like... You know, the gameplay is just quick and fast, boom, you're dead, boom, you're dead. It's not, oh, I'm going to sprint away and just run away, you know. Like, there's none of that. If you push forward, and you push at the wrong moment, and you got two guys shooting at you, you're supposed to die, not just sprint away and then survive that. That's not supposed to happen. You know, unless you have rockets or, you know, you get lucky two no-scopes, which would be insane, but it's happened before, I'm pretty sure. But, you know, I just think that stuff like that really made Reach a bad game. You know, I still played it and I still tried to enjoy it. You know, sometimes I would, but it's just I would never get the same feeling that I would from Halo 2 or 3 or Halo 1. So game let me go to another over. map. Now, you guys, I'm going to have to keep this short and quick because I don't really have much space left in my SSD. So, yeah, I'm going to keep it short and sweet. Um, let's see. I'm going to choose this one. Now, this is Guardian, you know, from Halo 3. One of the most popular maps in Halo 3 because of how small it is, be it how Slayer. symmetrical it, it is. Now, this is obviously a redesign. It's based off of Guardian. It's not the complete, you know, detail to detail, whatever. It's, you know, it's not like that. I mean, you got a fucking ghost in here. That's obviously not true to the design of, you know, the Halo 3 style. And then you, this is supposed to be the green area, you know, with the trees and stuff, but instead it's, look at this space. There's so much space, and you got the lava going down there. I don't even know how he got that skin, but whatever. Um, what was I gonna say? Yeah, like, this is, uh, the roundabout, you could say. You know, there's green right there, and you got sniper spawn, except... The only issue is, is that there is no sniper spawn. It's non-existent. Which... It's to be expected, because it's only a redesign, and an active camo would spawn right there. And then you got that lift. You know, I already spawned here, I'm just going in a circle now. I'm gonna get the hell out of here. Oh yeah, I forgot too, there's no fall damage. I like that. Um, what was I gonna do? Oh yeah, the overshield spawns are right there. An active camo, I think, uh, spawns on the other side. The only thing I don't like is the fact that it, uh, you know, you spawn right here and you go in here, you have that five second, re you know, invincibility. 
you could just do this. So yeah, sniper spawns right here. That's another thing too, like right when you do that, you know, you pick up the overshield and you already have the sniper, like you're just gonna be a complete badass. Like, look out, we got a badass over here. That's pretty much what would happen. And then you got this room, you know, active camo, and then that, teleporter, and then you got this. This is crazy. Like, look at all this shit going on here. Might as well just add a fucking rocket in here. It's just nuts. And then, you know, the sword spawns, like, right there. And the other Guardian version that I have, it's actually a gravity hammer, but it's not really a good design. I mean, it has the same, like, design. It's just the way it plays. It's just kind of, I don't know. Pretty much based off the sword. I just went in a fucking circle again, didn't I? Wow. I am just being an idiot. Alright, well, I'm just gonna keep it short. Honestly, like, I think you guys get the game idea. Over. Halo 2 PC is a great game, but it's so undermined by how it wasn't really necessarily a good PC port. Because you could still see, you know, the A select and the B select on the bottom, like that. See, show gamer card. Yet. You know, I can use my mouse, as you can see, and, I mean, it's just, if, little, if, you know, maybe if it wasn't like that, it'd probably play better, but I don't know. I just, uh, you know, if you guys could ever, if you guys ever want to play this game with me, please hit me up, because we need more players, because this is fucking ridiculous. You got all of this going on, and yet no one is playing. And pretty much those people right there, those are pretty much the people that only play. And then there's like maybe, maybe, what, 30 more people, 40 more people, and that's it. So, yeah, that that's it for this video, you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you can, please like the video. And just, you know, get this around, you know, just share it with people and... Let them know, because this game should not die so that easily. You know, this is Halo fucking 2. You understand me, boy, huh? No, I'm kidding. Sorry, I had my rage kind of got out of my system. But my point I'm trying to say is just please, please, don't let this game die. Not just yet. We should play it at least until Halo 4 comes out. So, nice, nice seeing you guys. Well, not really seeing you, but... Hope you guys just enjoy the video, whatever. See you guys later.